these are the tools and equipment that will that you'll need as we begin the first demonstration. You'll see over here there's thread. I'll explain more about the thread. It's cotton thread and on a different spool and this is polyester thread. I will talk more about that. You'll need a thimble, a pin cushion, a tape measure, an iron, some dressmaking pins, a pair of scissors, and some cotton fabric. You'll need some cotton to work on. Now what I have here and many of you will have this and that's why I'm suggesting you might want to use it. It's an old pillowcase for your bed. It's a, an old cotton pillowcase. It's 100% cotton. I'll just show you. It's been washed many, many times and it's not good enough to use for bedding now but I just had it sitting around and maybe you have this as well. This would be perfect for our sampler. Now we're going to begin by using cotton thread in a contrasting color so that you can see your stitch work on the cotton. And I want to just point out that the label for your thread is at one end or the other or if you have a spool here you can see that it's silk finish cotton. This thread where it says 100 percent polyester don't use the polyester because it knots up so we're going to thread our needle so here's the end, and I'm going to cut off the thread here. I'm going to thread the needle. Okay, I hold it with my right hand and knot it with my left hand. And now we have the thread ready to use. Just to get the feel of it, we're going to insert the needle into the thread and I'm going to put my thimble on, my sewing hand, the middle finger, and pick up the thread or the fabric and just practice a little bit, taking one stitch at a time. If you've never done this, well, this will probably feel a little awkward. Now, what I'm doing is I'm putting the needle in, I'm pushing it through with this finger and bringing the needle out, pushing it through, coming and grabbing it and pulling it. It's just a repetitive action. So what we're working on here is called a running stitch. Okay, there we are just a simple running stitch. I want to show you a way of handling the fabric while you're working on it which makes it easier than the way that I showed you before. If you have your left hand available, if you're a right-handed sewer, of course if you're left-handed sewer then it would be the opposite. So you can grab the fabric or let it rest on your hand and use that to guide your work as you go through. You'll see that you have more control if you're able to rest your hand underneath the work. You can feel it coming through here and you can help guide it up from behind as you're making your stitches.
Now the next thing I want to point out is that when you are stitching a running stitch that it can be made in different stitch lengths. It can be shorter or longer, but the idea is to get the thread and the spaces even. So that's a little bit shorter than the last one I showed you, but it can also be made much shorter. You can make them closer together. A quick review, 100% cotton, 100% cotton thread, your needle, your thimble, and your scissors. So thread your needle, and you're going to thread the needle as it comes off, or use the thread as it comes off the spool, pull it through, Unravel, snip your thread, wrap the thread, and knot it. So now you have your thread ready to use. Okay, let me just demonstrate that one more time. I'll use a different thread so you don't get hung up on which thread I'm using. It's cotton, cotton thread. Take it off the spool. Feed the end into your needle, but if it's not a clean cut, cut it on an, on an angle, not this way, but cut it on an angle. Oh, did you notice how I use the scissors? I don't bother taking the time to put my hands through there just for snipping thread. You just manipulate the blades. Quickly, you thread it through your needle, pull off thread not too long, snip the thread, smoothen out your thread, wrap it around your fingers and knot your thread. Done. Now you're ready to begin. It's, it becomes a very quick action. Then you're ready to begin your stitching.